Okay. How's it going, guys? Definitive baseball release night. We got the first one filled. We got Jaron, Tommy, Crowder, Trevor, Haig, Braulio, and Bill B. Everyone's got one except for Braulio. He's doubling up on this one. So, last spot picks the box. It'll be Bill Beck's choice. Here is the first case being opened, and good luck to you all. How's it going, Tommy G? Okay, Bill. Left, middle, right. Nice and easy here. We'll take off the randomizer. We'll do that after the box break. Of course. Going with the right box. These two will live to uh, die another break. Great if I could get my camera to not appear caca. How's it going, Joe? How's the Big Apple treating you this summer? God, I gotta stop saying summer. It's not summer yet. This spring! Just in time for the first definitive. Oh! Ah. Two metal cards in there. Slow with these. There's one massive card on the bottom. There's one card right there. Woohoo! Okay. Here we go. Nobody knows what they're going to get yet. Enjoy. Ready, Freeman, framed, patch, auto to start. Let me grab some sleeves. Triple color, game used, on card ink. That is beautiful. Beautiful card. We have a redemption. Can I get an F Tim from Joe? Pete Alonzo, definitive rookie auto, green parallel. And again, Actually, never mind, it's not a hit draft. So you guys can talk about value all you want. I was going to say blah, 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 don't talk value, but it doesn't matter. Next card up. Let's bring the uh, little reveal card. Another frame, this one's gold. Luis Severino out of 30. Streaky ink, nice pinstripe though, gray and white. Good stuff. Little dirty jersey there in the middle too. Little dirty jersey. Two frames out. Oh my god, we have a jaw dropping duel. Like, jaw dropping. Especially for a lot of people in this group. Not named Crowder. Not gonna be your favorite card, John, but a lot of others will. Beautiful! Gibby and Ozzy, 10 out of 10. Take the Cardinals logos off that, Crowder. You'd be pumped for that, right? That is beautiful. On card, Ozzy and Gibby. 10 out of 10. A little purple parallel. Got a game used white jersey for Ozzy. Game used bat. Actually, I can't tell who's is who's. I would assume the bat is Ozzy's, the jersey is Gibby. Agreed, Crowder. Robin definitely looking for the owner of this card. We got four pretty damn awesome cards so far. Sevy probably the worst, I'd say. Okay. Next up. Bregman! 16 out of 50. Game use jumbo. On card ink on that. Charles's boy. Card number five. We got six, seven, and eight coming up next. Uh oh, Lauren. Nope, never mind. Not him. Not Mattingly. Matsui, though. He sells. 24 to 25. Pinstripe on card auto. I think everything's on card in this. I don't think there's any stickers. Oh, 
Beautiful Matsui. I really thought it was Donnie at first. You know, from that far away, it kind of looks like Donnie. When this is all you see. <laughs> okay. We got just the relics left. First up, Big Poppy, 2 out of 50. Game use, let's see what the number is, 848257JC, if you want to look up what game that was used in. Could have been an all-star game, could have been a regular season game. If anyone wants to look it up, feel free. 2 out of 50, Big Poppy. And then we got this massive card that has a piece of a game used helmet by the looks. Last card in the first definitive box. Game used helmet of Reese for the Phillies. No sleeve for that bad boy. Six out of 35 on the Reese Hoskins game used helmet. A little bit of life to it, kind of hard to show on screen. Just shows up as black, but it's actually navy. Navy-ish blue. Oh yeah, scuffed up, game used, man. Probably got tossed off his helmet, or tossed off to the ground. Let's see if they tell you exactly what it was. Definitive helmet collection relic of Reese Hoskins. There we go. Okay, first box in the books. Let me just type this up. I'll bring it right up screen, right on screen as I do. I think Ronnie already logged them all for me as we we're going, so this will go quick. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. There we go. Got the Freeman Redemption, or the Freeman Patch, the Alonzo Green Redemption, the Severino Frame, Gibby Smith Duel, Bregman Relic Auto, Matsui Relic Auto, Big Poppy, and Hoskins. He even put on the serial numbers for you guys. You believe that? Ronnie, Ronnie B going be uh, uh, above and beyond. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Good luck, everyone. Standard randomizer, we go to the dice. Fresh pair. Three rolls, gotta be at least minimum of three on the dice. If it's snake eyes, we go one additional. There's one, two, and three. Six and three, nine presses on each side. Names first. Flying through. Beautiful card, Robin. I'll show you in a second. There's your spots locked, and let's see what you guys get matched up with. Here we go. Nine presses. And one more. Two more. There we go. Final press. Boom. Jaron gets the Alonzo Green. Tommy G, the Severino. Trevor, the Matsui. Bill B, the Brugman. Haig. PC Big Poppy, at least. Crowder, you got the Cardinals duel. What are the friggin' odds? And Braulio, you got the Freeman patch auto frame and the Hoskins helmet relic. There you go. You guys want to grab spots for number two? Here is the link. I don't think we got a case hit or anything uh, case hit-esque out of that. Mr. De Bruin, how's it going, man? Pretty good, that was the first one. Robin, here's that duel. Oh, Gibby and Ozzy. And the man named Crowder just hit it. You two may have to discuss. Uh, this is a unlicensed song, Lauren. It's uh, Salt Lake Seagull by Chris Shards. <laughs> All right, let me save this.